Hello and welcome back here on the Grizzlyfy channel. My name is Elias and in today's video we will talk about OPBNB, what OPBNB stands for, what it is, what our upcoming testnet release is all about and what our also future plans are with OPBNB. So first of all, what is OPBNB? What does it stand for? OPBNB is a layer 2 scaling solution. BNB in mainnet is a layer 1, such as like Ethereum and as Ethereum they also want to optimize gas fees now, transaction speeds and so on. They don't have such a big problem as Ethereum because when they forked Ethereum, they already made some slight changes, but they still want to optimize it. And they optimize it by introducing a layer two solution, which is utilizing optimistic rollup technology. Rollup technologies is one option to also scale Ethereum. They are currently in use by Arbitrum Optimism and it's one option for layer 2 solutions to just scale the Ethereum network. And the same is now utilized for the BNB chain and this is called OP Optimistic or Optimized. I saw various options what OP means in that context. Probably you can comment under the video if you know so. But the interesting thing is that they will scale the blockchain up in this way. Now the interesting thing for us is when we are when we thought about launching this perpetual trading dex we also came in contact with the binance smart chain and obviously the op bnb idea and we thought instantly hey this is a match because we are developing a dex and obviously dexes are in need of fast transaction times and low fees that's interesting to everyone so we instantly thought hey we have to utilize that we have to go on the test net as soon as possible and also be ready for the mainnet as soon as it will be released we're currently planning about the mainnet release we don't know yet exactly when the mainnet release will be but we will be there and with that being said, I want to talk about the narrative. Why do we even do that? What is our idea? And for us, it's super interesting to see. When you look at certain blockchains, you always see certain big players. When we look at Arbitrum, we always think of GMX. When we look at Ethereum, we think of Lido. We think of Uniswap. There are always certain big players on certain chains. And with the OP BNB chain launching in a bit, we have a crazy, crazy narrative that we can instantly push on we have a cool opportunity to establish ourselves on a new chain which we already have friendly contact with because we know the BNB chain network already quite a bit since we were quite a big player also on the BNB chain already since a while so we have some home advantage and we want to play that out by being one of the first protocols and the first decentralized perpetual trading exchange on OPBNB. And this is actually what we are aiming for. Our planned launch for OPBNB will be on the 30th of June. So, and with that being said, definitely check out how you can participate on Grizzly Trade within the OPBNB testnet. It should be something super, super easy. I'm not yet familiar with it. I'm really trying to also push out a content piece in written or video form where it is exactly explained how you can participate. But it will be anyways super, super easy. Exactly. And why is the OP BNB chain actually super interesting for us? Besides the narrative, obviously, the OP BNB chain is also aiming to speed up transactions and to put really lower transaction fees on the BNB chain. As mentioned, the BNB chain is already super cheap, but with the OP BNB layer 2, it will be so much cheaper. And this really brings us into a new direction also in terms of mass adoption. And we think OPBNB over the long term, especially thinking about the next bull run, will be a chain which can establish itself with under the top, top chains. So we also think Binance is a super smart player in the game, obviously the biggest one, I think at the moment. And they did a great job establishing themselves so far. And I think with the OPBNB chain, they did a, a great step into the right direction because they want to establish themselves with under the layer two solutions, which a lot of protocols can build on. And a low transaction fees everyone loves and where people are protocols build and therefore they will build on top of OPBNB and it can be a big, big player. And we want to establish ourselves, as I mentioned, as one of the first protocols, having a first mover advantage is always cool. And we have some friendly contacts there so we are very good to go. Exactly, with that being said, I really hope that I were able to give you a brief insight what our thoughts there are. 
our steps there are and with that being said i wish you a very nice rest of your day i really hope that you are as hyped as we are it will be a cool time coming for us so enjoy and we will see each other in the next video bye bye